William Paley described God as a watchmaker. Would God be better described today as a genetic programmer or engineer? I think every age tries to describe life and, and things pertaining to life in terms of the newest machinery that they are familiar with. And William Paley in the early 1800s, uh, 1800s mechanical contrivances were still uh, relatively new and still evoked uh, you know, a, a sense of wonderment as, as they should. They're really neat. And uh, Paley then uh, uh, used a watch as an example of something that was designed and then showed how a number of organisms had uh, very complex features that would put the watch to shame and, and then extended the analogy and said, just as the watch had a maker, uh, so did the, uh, the organisms. And uh, many people today say, liken, uh, liken organisms to, or liken DNA to a set of computer instructions. Uh, and so they ascribe, um, the, they like to make the analogy that just as a computer program required a programmer, life required a, a programmer as well. And uh, that analogy is, I think, is somewhat less charming than, than William Paley's analogy, but it makes the same point. And, and I think both Paley's and the, this analogy are equally valid. Uh, in any age, uh, we see the, the problem of the complexity of living systems, the fact that complex systems are put together by intelligent agents, and we naturally make the uh, association that that life, too, required a, a, a maker.